YouTube, how the fudge you doing? Hey guys, Nate Shot. Today, I'm bringing a brand new video. I'm so excited today because we are going to be opening up rare supply drops for this entire video. An update just came out on Black Ops 3 that allows you to use real money to buy these things called Call of Duty points, and you can use those Call of Duty points to open up rare supply drops. So, I spent about $150 on these. I know it seems like a lot of money, but I feel like this is going to be great entertainment, and I really love all the camos that they have on Black Ops 3. And since I play the game like five to six hours a day i want to have the best looking guns and this is not a promotional video for treyarch or call of duty i've done these on advanced warfare plenty of times so don't sit here thinking that i'm a sellout i just actually love this stuff and i know a lot of people are against spending money to buy these rare supply drops or whatever it may be but it's not like advanced warfare where you get better guns this isn't pay to play i'm deciding to use my money to make my guns look better whether you guys agree with that or not i i still think this is going to be really really fun so I've spent about $150. I have 18,700 uh, Call of Duty points. And that opens and equates to about 93 rare supply drops. So this is going to be incredible. Hopefully we get some really awesome stuff. They just buffed the supply drops, the, uh, the rare edition, so that you get a guaranteed weapon this time or specialist item. Instead of getting like a calling card, they're guaranteeing you a weapon. So they got a lot better. We're going to get straight into this. I hope you guys enjoy the video. Okay, so we're not going to wait any longer. We're going to go with our first rare supply drop. We're just going to breeze right through these. I'm so psyched to see what I get man i hope it's really something good we spearhead dracon rapid fire variant i really i don't need it but i got a bonus of five crypto keys oh i got a rare krm 262 i like that that's a that's a fun shotgun to use but i really don't use the shotguns too often that dust camo even though it's common actually looks pretty good <laughs> for this pistol I, I i i don't know uh like i said I'm, I'm looking for like the mainstream weapons um ooh, the jungle part oh god damn what is that caterpillar head theme is whoa yo is that actually for can i use that for overdrive because i use that in all my gb tournaments yo these are some sick additions man they added some good stuff in here we've got so many more to go though <laughs> like we're not even close and we're just gonna keep getting sick stuff i'm hoping for some epics here uh we get a cash money Ooh, we get a 20 crypto key bonus with every single one that we open oh my god yo this is actually a sick way of, of of doing this what is this trade again so we don't even have to back out at all we can just go straight over to this left side and we can open them really fast Ooh, the swindler combat knife that looks dope i can't even lie that looks incredibly sick. Homies, I had to take us in to check it out on the knife. Yo, that looks incredible. You've got like the green, the yellow, and the red just vibing through. And the sides of the blade are actually like illuminated. Okay, that's a sick pickup, man. I don't use the combat knife too often, but I think I'm going to start. I'd say so far we've had some pretty good luck, to be honest. But we got, we've, only, we've only opened three so far. We got the windmill calling card. Oh my god, what is this? I just saw the legendary. I got excited. The Haymaker 12 extended mag variant. Mm, I'm probably not going to use that. So we're just going to keep on going. We have so many that if I'm not overly excited. Oh, let's go. We got the ice for the XR2. That is going to look so dope on an assault rifle that I actually use in pubs. I'm about to be looking nice with the XR2. I use this a lot with rapid fire. You guys have seen it on my second channel. I have the Journey to 10th Prestige series where I play a bunch of pubs. I use the XR2 all the time. I'm not kidding. I'm actually really amped up about that. We we'll keep on going though, bro. We got 18,000 COD points to go through, okay? This is not a joke. We've got the monochrome black cell. Don't use it at all, but it is an epic item, so I got to be excited about it. Not going to... Ooh, the fire brand on the Locust. Let's go, man. I'd love to get something on the SVG, but I will take a legendary drop on a mainstream weapon like the Locust any day. I love it, man. We've gotten some good luck so far. I mean, I know this is pretty common. Ooh, the Northwoods grip variant. I don't use grip on an M8, though. So I'm not, you know, freaking out over that. We've, oh, we got the ice on the 205 Brecky, Bressy camo. Ooh, another shotgun. The uh, that that storm reticle actually looks pretty cool though. I ain't even, I ain't even gonna lie. I don't know why that looks so cool, but it looks like a thunder. I mean, it's it's a storm, so it's supposed to look like a damn thunderstorm. Well, let's see a battery threatened gesture. Eh, eh. This was awful. 
Not even... Nah, I'm not even about it. I don't really care about the gestures at all, to be honest. I wish those weren't included in this. The, the gestures are pretty whack. Oh! Let's go! Guys! The L car! I use this damn weapon so much. And that kind of looks like dark matter in a way. That's the closest I think you're going to get to a dark matter camo when doing any of this. Let's go. I use the L car in like every match that I play in. I'm hyped. I'm keeping that. I'm going to show you guys what that looks like a little bit later because that I'm actually stoked about that. We got... What I like about this, too, is I'm getting crypto key bonuses on the right. So the more I open these, the more crypto keys I actually get. I don't know what it is right now about the ice camo on these man on, on these weapons, but I got it on the man of war now. Another assault rifle with the uh, the the uh, the ice camo. And then we got the rapid fire variant on the Vesper. I'm definitely not going to use rapid fire on the Vesper, though. That gun shoots incredibly quick as it is. That would be pointless. Yes! Transgression on the SVG 100! This is the sniper that I use in game battles, matches, and competitive. We got transgression on the SVG. You already know you're about to see some more overkill sniping in the road to 100 and 0 on my second channel. Guys, I don't mean to put in a shameless plug here, but I upload like three Call of Duty videos to my second channel every single day. So go check it out. There's a link in the description below. You're missing out. I promise you. Competitive COD is, is thriving on that channel. So we've got the transgression SVG 100 camo. That looks so sick. I'm going to give you guys a recap of all the camos I got at the end of this. I, I don't... Ooh, the Nomad Caterpillar. I don't really use Nopad, Nomad at all, but that, that Battle Cruiser kind of reminds me of StarCraft. That actually looks pretty dope. We still got 15,000 COD points to go through here. I see... Ooh, oh! Buff the Weevil! We got the War Torn Weevil! Buff it! Buff the Weevil! Let's go, baby! We are racking in these camos right now. Ah, we're getting mainstream weapons too. We're not getting stuff that I don't even use. We're actually getting things that I'm hyped about. Buff the Weevil, man. That's my gun right there. We got a legendary rapid fire variant. I think we already got that. So I'm not really too concerned. I don't really use the Reaper. So the night camo is not too appealing to me. We got the SVG transgression camo again. We're going to be able to sell that for a nice duplicate item. Get some more crypto keys out of this. We're just going to keep on going. I can't believe I just got that again. I wonder if that's a common drop uh, with the epic items. Who knows? Ooh, the fire break caterpillar helmet. That actually looks pretty sick. Yo, we got our first butterfly knife. If you guys haven't seen this at all, I will show you guys, like I said at the end of the video, a lot of the items that I've gotten. This is actually dope. It's sort of similar to CSGO. You can do animations with it, and it, and, and it looks awesome. Oop, I accidentally backed out right there. I'm going to keep on opening. We'll make our way through all of these. I'm hoping. Ooh, I got another transgression camo. Ooh, that sunshine camo looks pretty good on the BMR or the BRM. But unfortunately, don't really use that at all, really. So I'm not, I'm not too concerned. Hey, another Weevil camo. I like that. We got a legendary taunt uh, for the Seraph. Don't really use that class either. Looking for maybe some psychosis classes. Ooh, the royal on the Weevil. Yo, David Vonderhaar must have put a buff on my uh, account because I'm getting all types of Weevil camos, and these actually look really sick. So I'm going to keep on moving right through, man. I'm hoping for another MA camo. Ooh, we got the storm camo on the MR6. Don't really use that pistol too often, but we got a heat camo for the VMP. Which is awesome because I use the VMP uh, in pubs quite a bit. Look at that cute little puppy on that little calling card. And we got another uh, Reaper. And we got that Phoenix calling card, which actually looks really dope. Wow. I'm conflicted, man, because all this stuff seems pretty cool. And I just don't know what I'm going to use when I have all of this stuff. Uh, we got... Mm, those, are, I, those are always kind of a letdown when I get those, to be honest with you. I don't, I don't really want the taunts. Maybe if I... Oh, we got the wrench. This is the first time that I've seen the wrench on, on my game at all. Guys, this is a, in form of a combat knife. You can have the wrench. You can have the butterfly knife. You can have that sick knife that I unlocked earlier. So I'm going to have to check out the wrench after this. Moving on to uh, some more. We've got so many COD points. We're just going to keep on moving through. 
Ooh, we got the Fast Mag variant on my Vesper. I actually do use Fast Mag on my Vesper, so that's going to come in handy. Another legendary item. I'm hoping for some more epics, guys. If you could send me some good vibes, man, I'd appreciate it very much. Oh, man. I really, like, I don't want shotgun camos at all. I know I just got a good item, and I should be grateful, but I don't really use shotguns too much, man. Let me get some Vesper camos, some VMP camos, or some M8 camos. Please, man. I, 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 I'm tired of these... He's basic. Hey! Right when I brought it up, man. We got a light camo for our Vesper. That looks like it's going to have a pretty good look to it. And we got the sunshine for the locusts, man. That's a pretty good drop right there. I really want to see what all these items look like. But I don't want to stop opening. I'm addicted. We got the transgression on the MR6. It's dope. I'm grateful. But I don't really use the MR6 compared to the L car or like the B23R or whatever. It's oh, we got the war torn on the XR2. So now that's two great camos that we've gotten for this gun, which is pretty exciting for me. I got another epic. Hell yeah. Man, I I'm getting all this sick stuff for the, for the XR2, man. Let me get some M8 camos, please. Please, please, please. Let me get some M8 camos, man. That's all I want for Christmas. Santa Claus, if you're listening, man, if you can make it happen for me, I'd very much appreciate it. Please. Uh, we still have a lot of COD points left, though. Ooh, the Locust CPU variant. Don't really use the Locust. Don't really use the Suppressor on the VMP. I'm just not... I'm not even going to slow down, man. We got the Storm on the XM53. That would be cool when I'm going for my Dark Matter camos just to have it on my launcher. But we still have 10,000 COD points. I'm not stopping for anything that I don't think is incredible. Eh. Pretty average drop. Nothing that I'm seeing that... Ooh. We got the Private School for the Seraph. Don't really use it, though. The Brim. The BRM. Don't use it, either. I'm looking for M8s, man. Ooh, the... Yo, it is the M8. Let's go. We got War Torn on the M8, boys. This is the gun that I use in all my game battles matches. It's the best AR you can use. And now we have it. The epic level M8 War Torn. I'm not sure if that's going to be replacing my Storm Camel. We'll have to see which one looks better, in my opinion. But hell yeah, let's go. As soon as we asked for it, we got it. And then we actually got a pretty dope-looking infrared camo for our pharaoh which is not uh it's not something to complain about at all hey the ice on the haymaker oh we got the illuminati uh for the specter yo I, i've seen the illuminati helmet it's actually got like a triangle on it but let's go man that double epic drop that is exactly what we were looking for we got 200 more cob points coming hey this is the legendary camo that kind of looks like dark matter it's the icr1 camo I don't really use the ICR-1 too much, but it's still... That camo is sick. I picked it up in a pub before. It looks incredible. Man, I'm getting all types of profit gestures and the Seraph and stuff. That variant on the laser sight looks pretty dope, too. We still... Oh man, <laughs> this is going to be a long video, bro. I did not realize how many COD points I actually bought. Like, especially with the crypto key bonuses that we're getting. We're going to have so many things to open. I don't really use the silence on the HVK. Hey, the Velociraptors calling card. I dig it. We got the cash money rune uh, boast. That might be something I'm into for sure. I see some yellow popping up. We might begin a legendary. Hey, boys, the Vesper. This is the gun I use the most, bro. I'm about to have transgression on my VMP or I'm transgression on my SVG 100 sniper with my overkill Vesper with that ice camo. Woo, I'm about to be living life, boys. This is what I'm talking about. The Jungle Party on the XR2. The Gorgon Extended... You don't need Extended Mag on an LMG, man. This game is tripping. I'm not even... I'm not ever going to use that variant. Ever, ever, ever. The Mongoose Cuda Mag variant. Ooh, I don't really use Extended Mag on the Cuda either. So, eh, yeah, I'm so happy about it. The Outrider Taunt. Let's go! The War Torn Camo on the, on the Razorback. Man, we are just racking that up on so many different weapons, dude. I'm vibing this. Ooh, we got the uh, the Hungry Zombie, and then we got the Argus Fast Mag variant. That's pretty cool, man. I could just make that. I didn't know they were giving us emblem drops. I had no idea. That's actually awesome because now I don't have to make it. I can make that my emblem right now and just throw like a nade shot under it or something. That one's kind of corny, though. I, 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 I doubt I'll use it, but if I could get some more default emblems that I don't have to make, I'll, I'm vibing that. I got the Hallucination Combat Knife. Got the HVK Spitfire Fast Mag variant. And we're just racking up these crypto keys, man. 
Oh, I saw the epic come up, but it's on the black cell. Not really going to use that at all, ever. So, I'm just moving right through. Open for a... Ooh, we got the transgression on the black cell now, too. What? What is it about the... The... The black cell, I don't know what it is, but we got some dope camos for our Gorgon and the HVK-30. At least when we use those guns, we won't use any basic camos. I'm into that. We got the heat. I've already gotten some sick Elkar camos, so I'm not really too concerned about anything else. Don't really need any more. Anything after this is just a bonus. I've got the ice on the KRM-262. The shotgun camos are, are coming in. Like, just flowing in like the, the dam is open. Ooh, the firebrand on the Shiva. All right. I can dig it. I'll take it. Got the kamikaze. Yo, is that some toast with some knives? Anybody seeing this with, like me? We got the epic for the nomad. I don't really use nomad too much, unfortunately. I might start using it now just because I got the epic, but eh, it's kind of eh, you know? Ooh, all right. And I get uh, the other part of that right after. And I do use quick draw on the KR KN44. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Uh Arapaima. Is that is that how you pronounce it? But that actually is a nice little variant there. I ship it. I ship it. I like it. Ooh, we got some alligators. Ooh, that that's a gigantic beast hunting down sharks in the ocean, bro. Or anybody seen that? I know that's got a name. That used to be like a creature that existed, I think. That looks like a, something like a dinosaur. Hey! War torn on the KN44, boy. Ooh, that calling card looks pretty dope too. The collector set, the Griffon, the Griffin. That looks great. Bro, I have so many sick calling cards. I'm gonna really have to try to decide if I wanna change up what I'm using right now. And I definitely gotta change my emblem. Hey, we got a quick draw variant for the M8. I think we got that earlier, but I'm definitely gonna use that. I use quick draw on my M8 pretty often. Ooh, the body bag, rune taunt. Ooh, the nomad taunt. Okay. Got some legendary items. Guys. Look at the right side of your screen. Oh, you can't see it. I'm up to 500 crypto keys right now. So if we want, we could ball out. Oh, transgression on the man of war. Hell yeah. Did I get that earlier? I'm not too sure. Guys, we're going to have to do an entire separate video for all these crypto keys I have because that is a lot of common supply drops if we want to use them on that. The dredge, not too bad. Infrared, I'll take it. We've still got tons of COD points. We're running right through. Ooh, yes! The HVK Ice of the 30 and the Man of War drop with the, the gem camo on the Man of War. Okay, this was this was a pickup, dude. Hell yeah, that's a pickup for sure right there. Our assault rifles are going to be looking nice in pubs. I'm going to throw rapid fire on that Man of War, go to work. The HVK 30, I have a class for that in pubs all the time. That was a good, that was a good pickup, man. We got an epic and a legendary item. That's what I like to see, man. I appreciate all you guys sending me the good vibes. Yo, guys, should we do should we do a nose pick here? All right, I'm using my nose. Let's see what we get. Oh, we, oh, we already have the Illuminati spec. I saw the epic and I got excited. I thought the nose pick really made a difference. I'm just gonna keep using my nose and see what happens. The samurai decal. Eh. Okay, let's keep opening. Oh, come on. I I, I, got, I even got bad aim with my nose. Who would have thought? Okay. What do you got for me in the black market, man? Well, you got what I need. You got that good stuff. I'm already hyped because we've gotten so many good things already, but we still have 3,700 points left. I'm just waiting to get something else. I wish you could unlock Dark Matter through these. I know that wouldn't be fair to everybody else, but I'm, I'm just so lazy that I don't want to have to go through the Dark Matter process. It just... It will take forever for me. Hey, transgression on the Argus. I heard that's actually a pretty good shotgun to use in competitive, man. You can really clear some sights. The monochrome on the dredge. That looks dope. The dredge is actually a pretty good gun to use. It's got that, like, I think it's like six rounds in every burst, and it's got a huge clip. It's a great LMG that could help you guys out. We got the ruin taunt and for boot. We got we're getting a lot of taunts right now. Alright, boys. We got about 2700 left of COD points. I think that's about 17 drops, or is that? 27 drops. Wait, 2,700. That's 14. Okay, I'm an idiot. Hey, we got War Torn on the Kuda now too, man. Let's go. I'm not used to getting all these War Torn camos, man. It must be a popular uh, drop on all these guns, man. I'm going to have War Torn on everything. I hope it looks good. I'm going to be pretty upset if it doesn't. Ooh, we got a whale calling card. Okay, that just looks funny. And then we get a dolphin. What is that? Are we going to get Aquaman next? <laughs> 
We're living life in the aquatic right now with all these creatures in the sea. KRM 262. Ah, man, it's kind of slowing down, man. You know, surprisingly, I don't think I'm getting really anything crazy until we get ice on the VMP. Thank you very much, Treyarch, for that. I'm not sure if we got that earlier, but our SMGs are going to be looking nice with the transgression again on the KRM KRM 262. I'm hoping maybe for some epic items on... Ooh, HVK Extended Man variant. Maybe some, like, if you have epic, like, customization for the Ruin class. Because I think if I'm using Overdrive a lot, I want to be balling. Man, 900 points left, guys. Let's see what we get. War Torn again on the CUDA. Man, I, I was really hoping for some variation in all this stuff. But it seems like I keep getting the same things with the same guns, man. I've gotten some good drops, though. I'm definitely not complaining by any means. But we got one more coming up. We got one more, and then I show you guys all the cool stuff that I got. And give you guys a nice little summary of everything that we have. So we're going to use our nose for this one. Might as well, right? See if we can get some good luck. Show me the money. Show me an epic or something. Ooh, we got the legendary battery taunt. Okay. So here's the thing, guys. We're going to burn all of our duplicates and see how many... Ooh, we've got 48 duplicates. Let's see how many crypto keys we get out of it. About to find out real quick because we might have to do another video bro we're already at a 20 minute long video and we have opened so many i got 142 crypto keys so i have 800 in total i could literally open so many common supply drops it's not even funny but guys that's gonna do it for openings on this video let me go show you guys all the cool camos that we got all right guys so i hopped into a free-for-all to show off a few of my favorite camos you guys have seen this storm on my second channel for ages now so i'm gonna show you guys the war torn but really quickly check out the gem on my l car when you're in the sun it's got these purple specks that almost kind of makes it look like dark matter and then you move into the shadows and it just gets darker like it's glow in the dark so Big fan of the L car already. This was a big pickup for me. I'm going to be using this in all my GB matches on the road to 100 no. Then we spawned in with the War Torn, and I actually thought this was going to be an animated camo. So I can't really decide besides this or the Storm. Let me know what you guys think in the comments below. You guys are going to be watching me use the M8 quite a bit. So I, I just don't know what I want to use yet. I, I really haven't figured it out. This actually still looks really sick. It looks like it's kind of got lava flowing through it. But I think I kind of like the coloring of the Storm camo on the M8. I'm not sure. And then on the L car, I think I have just... Uh, it's called Heat, I believe. And it kind of gives it this uh, burnt look with a little purple and yellow shading. I thought this was cool, but I definitely think Gem is going to be the one I use the most. Next, we're hopping on to our Vesper, which has this ice camo. With the Vesper, you don't get to see much of the camo except for the side of the gun. While I'm raw running, it looks pretty dope. It's got that baby blue look. If any of you guys are fans of college basketball, it's got them like UNC colors, and it looks phenomenal. And then when I take out my knife, I've got the butterfly knife. You see when I have it out, if I hit square, I can just go through this animation sort of somewhat like CSGO. And it looks pretty dope. So if you're just kind of sitting in a corner, got nothing to do, you can swing your knife around. This is the new butterfly knife. It looks absolutely awesome. And the ice camo complements it really well in the Vesper class. Moving on, guys. I want to show off the transgression camo on my SVG sniper. This looks dope. Kind of reminds me of Red Tiger from Call of Duty 4. I'm sure a lot of you guys never got to play it. But if you did, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Absolutely looks sick. And then I take out my secondary. I got the gem red versus blue on my L car. This is going to be a class to use. You guys are going to see me use this so much. And the road to 100 on those 2v2 GB doubles that we're doing on the second channel with bows. Ah, man, I'm so happy about the transgression. I can't even lie. Last but not least, I wanted to show off the gem man of war that I unlocked. I don't really use this in competitive too much, but in pubs, throw a little bit of rapid fire on here. And this gun is absolutely lethal. The gem looks incredible. I'm a big fan of this camo. I wish I had it on my M8, dude. I really do, because I'd probably be using that over the storm and the war torn and then i bring out the wrench this is why i made this look at this big thing man you can just it's like you're smacking your hand come here you little shit i'm gonna come fuck you up come here you little asshole and it's just like you're smacking your wrench across the hand can you imagine someone knocking over the head with this oh my god dude it's such, a, such an obnoxious thing to add to the game but guys i think that's gonna do it here for me today i hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing we opened an obnoxious amount of rare supply drops i think it was it had to be at least over 100 if not more 
Uh, so we got some pretty sick items. The camos look great. You're going to see them on my guns throughout all these gameplays that you see on my channel. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys could drop a thumbs up, it would mean a lot. I would very much appreciate it. I hope you guys all have a wonderful day. And YouTube, we'll see you fudging later. Goodbye.